Life at Sycamore Ridge. I started watching Life at Sycamore Ridge during the case of the missing drone. And, like, this drone was lost and all alone out there in the wilderness. And, like, even the dog was looking for it. Now, some things that they lose, yeah, it's not as easily replaced as a drone. Life at Sycamore Ridge always manages to teach me something. Like, how weed tea isn't exactly what it sounds like. Except it is. That may look like a cup of urine with a cauliflower aftertaste. <laughs> But that's how it's supposed to taste. Oddly enough, it has nothing to do with the delightful toilet story. Life at Sycamore Ridge likes to share the insider information of running their farm, and they like to crunch numbers and do chicken math. They show stuff that only, like, the serious chicken people know about. For instance, how to waterboard a chicken when it eats your kale. <laughs> Talk, chicken. <laughs> Tell him anything. <laughs> hey, what do you call a chicken that's been interrogated? A grilled chicken. <laughs> so if quail or chickens don't float your boat, maybe the goats can do the job. They got a few of them. Or maybe for you, it's all about the bees. They have a few of those too. Life at Sycamore Ridge does garden work also, but the majority of the videos are geared more toward the critter side of farm life. And there's a bunch of critters. Cats and birds and rabbits and dogs. They don't normally keep their meat birds cramped like this. They just have to do flock maintenance that day. So Life at Sycamore Ridge believes in ethical treatment of their critters and humans. And they have a few videos of their field trips to Equality Farms. So if you're wanting to see city slickers taking the farm by storm, and you like farm animals that do crazy stuff and put their caretakers into odd predicaments, Life at Sycamore Ridge will be a real treat. Check them out. Ruth Weichart. Ruth Weichart is a Filipina in Germany, and her mission on YouTube is to try and connect as many people as possible so no one has to be lonely. So she's live every day. Some of her chat is Tagalog, and some is English, and she's learning German. Now, not all of Ruth's uploads are from the live streams. There are a lot of videos that are just uploads that are like uh, vlogs. Um, what life in Germany is like from her point of view. Um, learning to live in another culture while keeping her family and friends from the Philippines close at heart. There are quite a few videos also of some of the neat trips around town and to a lot of the interesting attractions. And sometimes it's just her hanging out at home and just sharing things that are going on in the house or in the backyard. So if you'd like some YouTube connections, even if you can't stay long, drop in on Ruth Weichart and make a friend. Whit Acres Nature at Home Whit Acres is a food forest being built one plant at a time and is in the planning stage of becoming a self-sustaining paradise. This channel is full of all the tedious to-do list tasks that are required to build each square foot. And for the last 11 or so months, it's all been on YouTube for us to follow along. He has an aquatics channel also, but it's not updated as often as this one. Speaking of aquatics, he is quite serious about getting a nice home for his fish to live in, and he's planned a beautiful water feature. So watch and see if he's going to pull it off. It's going to be fun. I know it. So if you're interested in seeing a homestead turn into a paradise for nature's creatures, including Echo the Dog, Whit Acres Nature at Home could be your kind of channel. Farming, Chicken Math, and Frugal Living making long-term connections, building paradise one feature at a time. Are these your people?